How's it going guys and welcome to my next unboxing. This is an unboxing of Kingdom Come Deliverance. I'll tell you what, this is pretty hard to get your hands on, on certain websites. I normally like to get my games off uh, Amazon, but it's not in stock on there. And when I went on to game, um, basically they said that there's only like a maximum of two or three that you can buy at any one time because it's in high demand. So it seems to be popular at the moment and I've seen good reviews of it. I think it's one of those games where... You've got to be an avid RPG fan to really want to play it because certain people want it to be as easy as possible straight through. But you've really, this is as one of the most realistic RPGs that's out there uh, when it comes to actually have to train to be able to be good at certain things. So I'll actually get into the box and, and start talking about it anyway. Yeah, this is um, apparently it's one of those games where you've really got to be, you know, a big RPG fan certain things that has frustrated other people that's played it but from what i've heard from people that actually do like the rpgs and they like a bit of a challenge is it's a very good game so i actually get into the i'll get into the wrapper and i'll read there what it says on the back all right here we go this is the special edition including the treasures of the past in-game content or something like that of the past okay Xbox One X Enhanced, I've heard it's really good on that, I've got the Xbox One X now, I'm going to be doing a review of the console SAP, this is from Deep Silver Warhorse, and I don't know what the other company is, and it's rated an 18, okay, Bohemia 1403, the king is dead, turmoil reigns over the country, invading forces and spreading death and fear among the people, in the midst of these unfolding events, you, Henry, son of a blacksmith, are seeking revenge on the people who murdered your family and took away everything you ever held dear. Experience a story-driven first-person role-playing game based on historical events and fight for the future of your country. Explore a vast open world and discover majestic castles and landscapes. Solve quests with cunning skills and face the consequences of your decisions. Uh, choose your weapon, master your skills, and engage in merciless battles. So, you know, I've heard so much good stuff about this. Um, if you want to get good at sword fighting, you need to practice. If you want to get good at this, you want to get good at that. If you want to get good at, like, reading certain things, you need to actually read. It's one of those games where you've really got to play it as you would do in real life. So if you want to get good at something, you do need to practice. Practice makes perfect. And I've seen good reviews of it. I've watched many... I've watched at least 20, 25 videos of this because I wasn't sure to get it on that. But I remember when this was a... And I'm sure this was crowdfunded. I'm sure it were. And I remember seeing little bits of the yearly engine they had. And it looked amazing anyway. And I've seen the graphics. I've seen the weather. I've seen all the, the, all the little things... And I think if you're a fan of, say, Oblivion or Skyrim especially, I think this is right up your alley, but it's not going to be as easy as those games. So I'm up for the challenge anyway. Well, I'll redeem that anyway. What is that? Yeah, Treasures of the Past. I'll redeem that before I upload. And there's the disc. No background image or anything like that. So yeah, I'm looking forward to playing this. Uh, if you have already played this, uh, please let me know what you think. Um, I've heard it runs really good on the Xbox One X, I don't, and, and I've seen other people review it and say it looks really good on the, the PS4 Pro and the PlayStation 4 itself. So there you go, but I don't know if you should get it now at full price. It's cost me 45 I was saying I don't know if you should wait. Uh, to get it at a cheaper price, but I just wanted to buy it and play it now, so hopefully it's good and worth the money, but I do think it will be. So thanks for watching this video, guys. Really appreciate it. Have a good weekend and take care.